what is up all the peeps welcome back to a bloody viking gaming bloody here again with starbound super excited to be playing it again i hope you guys are having a good day a great day even if you're new to the channel and you haven't dropped a sub yet make sure you drop a sub support the channel it really helps me out haven't checked me out on twitter yet make sure you check me out on twitter at a bloody viking and if you want to catch a stream sometime make sure you hit me up on twitch twitch.tv forward slash a bloody viking let's get right into it peeps here now we are already starving and the last time that we took off or the last time we were playing this game we are going down to the current world okay, cool. last time we were playing this game we were struggling a little bit because we were trying to find the cotton that we need to make that t teddy bear because unless we make the teddy bear or until we make the teddy bear um we cannot actually continue through the game we can't it'll be impossible um because um we need to make the teddy bear so that we can like check out that thing and then once we check out that thing with the bear then we can like, finish the quest and do all the amazing things now in the meantime what we really need to do <clears throat> is we really need to find the cotton and we also really need to find some food the food is kind of a big issue for us at the moment. And it's kind of always been a little bit of an issue for us. We have always had a little bit of trouble finding food. Get out of here! Okay. So, I'm going to try to find us some food. I'm also going to try to find us some cotton. And, um... Yeah. Alright. <laughs> I'll see you guys in a little bit. What the? Oh my goodness! Are you a bad thing? I bet you're a bad thing. Whoa! Oh, you're a tough little bugger. Whoa! Oh my goodness! Holy cow! Okay, peeps. So what has been going on is that. Whoa! Wait. What is this? What are you thing? Are you just a normal thing? Oh. Crap, you are a normal thing. All right, well, so what I've been trying to do is I've been going around trying to find more of the cotton that we need to finish making this teddy bear, which is like, oh my gosh. I can't find it anywhere. Cannot find it anywhere. I know that there's a way that you can um, make like a hoe, like a tool, and, um, and do like a crop plot type, type thing and, and grow it. Um, but I don't think I don't have the you know materials necessary to make that so I've been trying to gather up a bunch of materials um, So that we can hopefully make some better tools uh, and hopefully move this along a little bit because gosh Well, it's not the most exciting thing ever <laughs> So um, but I just wanted to bring you back to show you um, we're down in this pr <gasps> pretty expansive mine. Let's pick this back up. Can we do it, please? Pick it up. Pick it up. Thank you. Oh my goodness. I did not know that was going to do that. Oh crap. We're going to die of hunger again. Story of my life. Of course, there's no food or anything around here to be found at all. Because there never is. Maybe there's something down here? I know there's a bad guy down there. Where you at, bad guy? I know you're nearby. Maybe he was the other way. Yep. Oh, I see him. Oh, I sees him. Come here, bad guy. Let's go. You want to make some of it? Let's do it. Oh, you're done. Oh, you done. You are so done. Okay. Let's get this silver because we also need to get the silver bars. You can see in the top right hand corner of our screen, there's a quest to, um, oh, that was cover ore. To acquire silver bars. Did we just get learn how to craft throwing bones, packing bones? Why do we need packing bones? That's what I want to know. So we're probably going to die here in a second, peeps, because we're just having all the struggles. We cannot get the... can't find food. We can't find cotton. We're just like... we're struggle bussing. We really are struggle bussing. 
So let's grab this copper, go back, oh, let's just chuck this down right here and kind of give ourselves a stairway back up. We got to kind of get, we got to get back up to the surface now. Um, we'll make our way back down here, I guess. Anyway, peeps, that's kind of the update for now. I'm just trying to gather stuff for us so that we can make stuff and kind of move on because I, just as much as you guys are, I want to do something different too. So, okay, apparently we can't jump up there. Let's hold on like, oh my goodness. What the? Okay. Um, so anyway, I'm going to get us back up to the surface, hopefully without dying, and then I'll see you guys in a little bit. Get dead, bad guy. Get dead. Wow, peeps. Okay, so we just had a terrible, terrible thing happen, and we died. But I've never seen these, like, little comet things. Oh, my gosh. That is so cool, peeps. This game is so beautiful. We're really fortunate to be playing a lot of really beautiful games on this channel. Okay, we don't have to kill you because you're a nice person. Animal thing. So, stay that way. We won't have a problem. And they are little comets. You can see that they give off... <gasps> Crap. <laughs> you can see that they give off light as they drop. We're back at daytime. My favorite time of the day is daytime. Because I can see what I'm doing. Now let's see if we can't get back to where our stuff is. Get dead, little creeps, get dead. Oh, 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 oh. Ah! Oh boy, that's it. We gotta take out a sword. We're taking out the sword. What happened to our sword? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Have some sword action. Yeah. Now luckily, the sword does not take up energy. It doesn't just right click. <gasps> Which sends out a wave of stuff that I've never seen before. Oh my gosh! I just remembered the ener needing taking energy from our previous sword. Oh my goodness! Yeah, let's go. Have some sword. Are you frozen? Are you frozen or something? Oh, what does it even do? That's what I want to know. Does it freeze him? No, it just makes him all weird. Huh. Okay. All right. Try number eighty-seven. Don't need to kill you. Unicorn face bear demon, whatever your thing is. Have some sword. Oh, Jesus, crow. Oh, we're too high. Let's see if we can just go down here. Oh crap! I meant to jump. Jump attack. Mm, have some sword. Okay, or not. Okay. 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 Much, much better. Now, we should have some of these things that we need right here. Heal up. Okay. It's going to apparently be impossible for us to get back to the surface. Okay, peeps, we are back up at the ship. I am going to just kind of take a look and see what we can do here with some of the resources that we have obtained. Okay, let's make five of those. Let's make a buttload of these. And let's make a big old buttload of these. Okay. Sweet. That's all we can do. Glass. We can make glass with sand. How many can we make? Holy cow. All right, let's just make like 10. And we can make an empty bottle. Oh, and that just takes glass. Hmm. Ah, look at us making all the things. Okay, sweet. That looks awesome. Now, what can we do in here? We do not want that. What about in here? Any stuff like that? Mm, no, cover. Okay, okay, okay. That's for building stuff man okay it's gonna be crazy building a base in here it is going to be super cray cray now here string we don't need string we need cotton wool and we need so much of it uh it makes me so salty peeps that we cannot figure out how to do this wait though tools no maybe over here 
can we make tools of any kind? No. Okay, peeps, we are back. So I did a little bit of research. I found out some things and I feel like I'm very much more knowledgeable now. So what we did was we came and we made some string. Well, first what we did was we picked up our um, inventory inventors table because we already had made all of the things we could make with the inventors table. And the nice thing about this game is if you make something uh, you can just suck it back up with your little collector thing and then you can like put it away or bring it back out for later So that's awesome. So we put down our Foraging table and so I looked at some of the recipes and one of the things that we need is a hoe <laughs> Moving on so we need a hoe and what I saw that I needed was string so we are going to make one of these um, I also found that there's a bunch of other things that we can make um there's a bug net, fishing rod, hunting bow, hunting spear, tungsten, hunting bow. There's also another um, tab over here for like light stuff, okay? Mining helmet, lantern stick, which is actually pretty cool. Um, flashlight, glass block, okay. Flares, explorers, lantern, which we need oil for, okay. All right, at any rate, we are definitely making some progress. So now we have a hoe, and um, <laughs> it looks so silly. So I think now what we're gonna do is we should head back down to the planet. Uh, we should see if we can kind of cultivate the earth down at the planet. And um, for what I did read was that in places that have like, um, a lot of rain stuff will grow pretty quickly and it'll become like good soil for growing pretty fast oh man I don't want to like to undo the stuff that I already you know hoed <laughs> but now I should be able to plant this oh I can look at it let's just plant all this stuff yo give me this you better grow that cotton. You better grow it right quick. Now, if I walk on it, do I ruin it? I don't want to test it. I do. Mm. Oh, okay. It doesn't ruin it if we walk on it. Okay. That is amazing. It is wonderful and amazing. So we now have amazing cotton plants that will grow. Do I know how long it will take for them to grow? No, I don't. So what we're going to do is we're going to take another break. I will bring you back once they are grown. We will collect our cotton, which should be enough to finish up our thing, I hope. And then we will make our teddy bear. I'll see you back in a flash, peeps. And we are back, peeps. Holy cow. Take a look. We have learned how to farm. I'm so excited about this. Oh, we got some more. Perfect timing, plant. Okay, so we had to wait about half an hour or so for the, our first cotton plants uh, to grow and actually produce pickable cotton. You can see this one is a little shorter. It's because I accidentally, well, not really accidentally, but for science, harvested the plant a couple times to try to see if the cotton was ready. Um, you can see that we do have some corn growing over here now. We have some tomatoes. Oh, potatoes. Potatoes. Oh. Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. We have some potatoes and corn, <laughs> and we have some cotton growing over here. So we have learned to farm. It's amazing. I harvested some of the cotton. Let's joink back up to the ship and see what we can make with all this lovely cotton. Cotton wool. Give it to me. You're killing me. Only one. How much do we need? And we need two more. Okay. Great. Not so great. Now, we do have more cotton fiber here and we do have our little fabric things and this right here as well can we make any more yes how about it how many do we need a oh, three okay craft it so now we have oh my goodness okay <laughs> we need four cotton wool and as you can see we have three 
we are going to have to wait for more cotton to grow. So I'm going to go back down to the planet <laughs> to see, um, well, not really see, but to basically, you know, watch the grass grow and uh, buy grass. <laughs> I mean cotton. Now, I'm thinking, and I'm going to time again to see, but I'm thinking that it is not going to take as long for this next batch of cotton to grow because of the fact that the plants are already fully matured. But we're going to find that out after. Um, also, a couple of quick notes. You do need the hoe to kind of cultivate the ground here. Okay, We can see that there's light dirt and we can see that there's dark dirt here. The light dirt is dirt that has been cultivated with our hoe but has not been watered yet or the water in the soil has been used. So it is of the utmost important that you are trying to grow your crops on a planet that where it rains a lot the rain is very 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 important luckily this planet does rain quite a bit so hopefully it will rain again soon I'm gonna wait for more cotton to grow we get about two cotton or so from each plant sometimes only one so anyway I'm gonna wait I'm gonna make up the rest of the wool that we need I'm gonna make that teddy bar and then we are finally going to finish this ding dang darn quest I will see you back in a little bit peeps And we are back, peeps. What is up? Okay, so it has been about 25 minutes or so, and we have gotten some more cotton. Yes, it rhymed. No, I didn't plan it. You're welcome. <laughs> Our corn, though, is not ready. Okay, that's kind of a big thing. That I planted very shortly after our cotton. Um, so I'm thinking this is going on now about 45 minutes just for the first batch. Our potatoes, however, boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. Look at them, are done. May I have it, please? Okay. Now, and we got the same number of seeds back as the plants that we planted. So we're, I'm just gonna go ahead and plant these back right here. I'm gonna just zoink this right back up to the ship. And we are going to see what we can do about getting some of this. I want... No. Huh? Wait. Yes. And this? No. Where do you go? Right here. And you. And this. Here. Thank you. This? Hello, Peter. This? Only one, right? Yep. Thank you, Teddy Bear. Dum -ba -da -da -dum 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 -dum. Holy cow, I'm so excited, peeps. Okay, we don't want to put that anywhere. Let's go right here for a second. Let's come over here. Let's put some of this away real quick. And let's get down to the outpost. Uh, this one, I think. Yeah, sure, why not? Okay, back down at the outpost. We need to come over here. Jump, 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 jump jump and let's talk to you Hooray! <laughs> awesome happy now thank you now i can finish opening up the shop okay hello thing what did we learn about everything we still did not learn about everything you're kidding me oh my goodness we forgot to do the teleporter thing okay return to esther at the ark all right Come and find me when you're ready. Oh, holy bejesus. Hooray, excellent work. It may seem trivial, but scanning is an essential skill that will be pivotal in your search for the artifacts. Okie dokie, what do we get? <coughs> An upgrade, oh, a manipulator module. Ooh, how many of these do we have? Just one. We need eight for that. We need six for that. We need 12 for that. We need three for this. For painting tiles, eh. We only have to collect liquids. Okay, not super duper concerned about that. Okay, lady, what do you got? Now that you're familiar with scanning, we need to start finding these artifacts, dear Florian one first. Their colonies will contain vital clues to its whereabouts. Florian live all over nowadays, but still prefer the dense forest vegetation of planets found around gentle stars. Good luck, dear, and thank you. Okay. Okay, let's go back up to our ship. Aha! 
Okay, peeps, we are back at the ship. Now that is where we are going to leave the episode today. I really hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. If you liked the video, drop a like. If you've got a comment, questions, or some constructive feedback, make sure you throw it down in the comments. I'm super excited for the next chapter. chapter. I hope you enjoyed it. If you're new to the channel and you haven't subbed yet, do me a favor, support the channel, drop a sub. If you haven't followed me on Twitter yet, make sure you check me out on Twitter at a bloody Viking. And if you want to catch a stream sometime, you know what to do. Check me out at twitch.tv forward slash a bloody Viking. Thanks again, peeps, for hanging out with me. I hope you have a wonderful morning, day, afternoon, evening, whatever it is for you. I love you all. And I will see you in the next one.